Richie, bulletin board out. Here's my AK. I took it to the range, 150 rounds, not one of them. Perfect. The bullet guide worked great. Uh, all the magazines I put in here, the mag posts, some steel ones, which I have no idea what they are, who they're from. I bought a gun shell. They worked fine. Uh, I had to modify my mag release to fit those. That worked fine. And the full conversion is complete. And it, I was very impressed by this rifle. Very impressed. Accurate too. Uh, the Vortex Spark with the American Defense mount. Everything worked perfect. You can see I have it taped up. So I'm, I'm going to paint this now. That's my phone. And I want to go for a distress look. The base color will be this with a little bit of brown and black. And then what I'm going to do in the black areas where I want a kind of black still, I'm going to make it distress with this matte silver. So I think it's going to turn out nice. I've seen some guys on YouTube who did it, what I'm kind of looking for, going to shoot for. So I'll show you guys. So that's it, Richie Bullets and Broadheads. This, I can see why guys become uh, and girls become AK fans because it was flawless. It ran absolutely flawless, accurate. Actually, this Ultimac, when I put it on, it was almost sighted in from my, right from my AR into here. I was surprised by that. It was low. I had to bring it up just a little bit, and uh, that was it. It was done. I had this sighted in in about 10 rounds. It was per pretty, you know, almost perfect. I did a 50 yard sight in. So uh, I should be good up to about 250, I guess, 300 yards. So uh, that's all I got is 50 yards right here in Jersey right now, the range I go. So I'm going to get this painted, and uh, I'll show you guys when it's done. Very impressed with this AK, this Sega. The conversion, everything I did, thank God, worked fine, is working fine, and uh, happy to report that. So let's get this painted. I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done. Hopefully it turns out good. So that's it, Richie, Bullet Jump Heads, over and out. Okay, here's the base coat. I'm gonna put about three coats on this on. <coughs> and then the rest will be distressed. That I'll do with a sponge and a brush. So, um, really looking forward to this. I think it's going to turn out look real sharp so it's not going to be perfect because I don't want it perfect I like that look so that's the base coat so far so good all right here's how it looks starting to get a little bit of that distress look See how that certain area is black? I'm gonna put that in like a matte silver. Make it look distressed black. Let me get the other side. I'm liking it. Gotta do some brushing with black and brown. It's gonna look nice when it's all done. There it is, man. Zombie gun, man. Pulse up the distress to the max. Got the Magpul M lock hand stop. Here's my Paraclip Magpul for the sling. I guess. Like I said, it's not perfect, and that's exactly what I was looking for. So that's it. Richie, Bulletin Broadheads, over and out.